Dock X shipping, the processing time, item still waiting, carrier pickup. My name is Quentin Banks. If you're new to the channel, of course, you guys got to like and subscribe. Today's video, we are going to be talking about Stock X. Let me know in the comment section if you guys have ordered from Stock X. Also, let me know if you're still waiting. Um, exactly what's going on now i will try my best to actually help you guys and put you guys in the right direction as always i know lots and lots and lots of people always ask me questions um regarding stock x so of course i'll go ahead and get that um get those questions answered right definitely get those questions answered and i'm um, assuming one moment here as i get this screenshot up if you guys got questions or you know Want to ask me any other questions? You can drop them below. Uh, some people as well tend to um, follow me on Instagram. I'll have my Instagram up and they'll um, actually DM me on Instagram. You know, so it's a case by case uh, basis where I actually try my best to actually, um, you know, like I said, respond back to everybody. Let's say you're selling a bottle of water, you post that bottle of water on Stock X. Somebody buys it um, from Stock X, um, you ship. So basically the item still waiting to carry your pickup. So if I ship the item out, um, it's been a stock X, stock X uh, delivers it. Oh, I'm sorry, stock X ships out, right? So stock X, uh, they ship it back out um, and it's basically stuck on that carrier. Um, it could be FedEx, USPS, UPS, or whatever that carrier is that they've used um, and it's just waiting to get picked up. Now, um, I got tons and tons of videos, you know, explaining the process and actually the process behind Stock X. Um, feel free to go to my channel. You'll see tons and tons of videos regarding that. Um, if not, just type in Stock X shipping. I already, I already made tons and tons of videos regarding this, you know, and I don't mind. I really don't mind and answering any questions, you know what I mean, re regarding that. So yeah, let me get right into the screenshot. This was a member of my channel. Like I said, I really do appreciate you guys. You guys always keep me updated and I actually try to keep everybody else updated as well. All right, so uh, somebody began to say, so I bought my PS5 Monday on January 10th and it took two days to ship the stock X. It got there Wednesday, January 12th. Then on Friday, it was authenticated now it's a waiting carrier pickup and it's been three days and just wondering if i should be worried or just being paranoid it's also snowing where i live that might have something to do with it as well now i really do believe um that snow does have something to do with it um i know you know um some carriers you know i can't speak for all carriers um i've had issues in the past with the ups uh, USPS um, when there was a snowstorm and it was just so many delays and you know we had to worry about s the snowstorm New Year's Christmas so it was a point in time you know where it's just you know you're worried about all that and then then there's delays right there's always going to be um, some type of delay some type of um, you know something kind of getting in the way right so with that being said um, you know it looks like this person actually bought a PS5. If you, bought, if you ever bought a PS5, let me know as well. Um, let me know how long that process was. Um, you know, I mean, I just want to see see how long that process was uh, with that PS5. Uh, somebody begin to say, I am having the same problem right now. The app has uh, said awaiting UPS pickup since Saturday. Now, I do want to let you guys know as well when you're when you're when you're seeing updates, right? And it says Saturday, Sunday. You know, just know um, nine times out of ten, it's mainly business days, right? You can't go around um, the business days, right, or just the weekend, you know, because, um, you know, some places aren't even open on the weekend, let alone, or I should say Sunday, and let alone sometimes, you know, a lot of people, they're not going to even want to ship things out on Sunday, you know what I mean, or, or they're working, you know what I mean, but um, as far as, you know, some places... Some post offices, they're not open. Sure, you guys stand as always. Um, like I said, I got a playlist on my channel, breaks down stock egg shipping, all of those questions, comments, concerns. Now, if you guys still want to win and be part of the giveaway, make sure you comment uh, below and just say enter me in the giveaway and I will enter you in the giveaway. It's very, very simple. I will do like cash apps or shoes. I don't know yet, right? I don't know yet, but we'll definitely, um, we'll definitely get that taken care of. Um, but yeah, like I said, make sure you follow me on Instagram, Twitter, 
all that information will be down below. Rick and Morty, LaMelo Ball, Puma One Edition. These are so, 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 so crazy. So fire. Whatever you want to put in there, insert that word. To me, these go crazy. Now, these are different. Trust me, these are different. As you guys can see with the colorway, it's like a um, green, red, different variations of the green and the red, as you guys can see there. These are the Ricky Morty editions. So, of course, this is like the perfect timing. Um, a lot of other athletes and a lot of designers have been using Rick and Morty. Um, so I guess it's just Rick and Morty's time. Now they got a collaboration with Puma. And oh, I have not wore these and I have not seen this specific colorway on feet. But I have um, seen the red. I think it's the red splash. If you guys want a free pair, make sure you guys comment below. Enter me in a uh, giveaway. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe. That way you guys are in tune with the latest and greatest information. If you like these shoes, like I said, drop the comments below. Let me know in the comment section. As always, my name is Quentin Banks. I will be bringing this content to you guys each and every day. So yeah, let's get right to this. Strictly from the LaMelo Ball collection with Puma. I'm actually looking online now as we speak. Because um, I was just wondering to myself, like, did these come out? Like, I don't see them in stores. You know, I seen somebody wearing them. Um, I seen some guy wearing these like last week, not last week, but um, last month, sometime last month. So I was just wondering if they were out. Um, and I'm checking the I'm checking the uh, Puma website. I definitely don't see them on there, um, but I do see them on Stock X. So if you guys do actually want to save 20% off on your Stock X order, I'll put that link in the description. So I am seeing these on Stock X. Um, and not even this colorway. So I shouldn't even say that I'm seeing. Let me show you guys which colorway I'm seeing. I'm not seeing the Rick and Morty. It's not loading up. Okay, the Red Blast. So the, they have the Red Blast. Let me just try to look. I'm gonna try to look that this up again. But they have the Red about the Red Blast, the Mellows. Okay, they're actually 185 for size 13. Um, size. So these can go. 15,000 size 15 so yeah so um these are pretty dope these are cool to me i mean i like them definitely like them as you guys can see there uh the mellow on the back tab as you guys can see the rick and morty little animation on the tongue i um, mean it's two different colors you know so um i think this colorway actually and the way they rolled this out i am very i'm very surprised i'm very shocked because this this is like a good rollout. You know, he dropped the first colorway, the Red Blast. Now he's just released some more colorways. And the colorways are like, they're crazy colorways. Like, I haven't seen, you know what I mean, a good collection of colorways in a while. Like, they, the way his colorways are coming. Um, and they look dope. And the, the sneaker is different too. You know what I mean? It's, it's definitely different. As you guys can see there, he really did take advantage of the color green. You know what I mean? Um, as you guys can see, there's a few different color uh, greens there. Um, to neon green, dark green. You know, just kind of play with those variations. Uh, the rare uh, Rick and Morty right there. And then the one of one uh, LaMelo ball on the tongue, which is fire. Then you have this colorway as well. You know, if you guys um, know anybody with these or, or got these, let me know in the comment section. Uh, let me know how, how these feel. You know, um, I haven't played basketball in these. Like I said, I've somebody showed me these. Uh, somebody was actually wearing these playing basketball. Uh, the Lamella Ball, the Red Blast. So I actually may get a pair of these, actually. So this might be my, uh, my next shoe. And it's like it's definitely for a good basketball shoe as well. You know, let me know in the comment section how you guys feel about these shoes. Uh, let me know as well what's your favorite shoe out right now. Um, like I said, to me, my favorite shoe, and it's always like this. It's like it's, it's like I'm all, my favorite shoe is always a shoe that I'm covering at that moment. I promise you guys, these are my favorite shoes. But these are one of my favorite shoes that I don't own, so I don't own these. Um, like I said, I don't even see these in stores, so like I don't even know how the release date goes. But as I said, uh, StockX, they does, they have these on, on uh, the StockX website. Feel free, um, use that 20% off as well on that. 
All right. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Let me know in the comment section how you guys feel. As always, my name is Quentin Banks. Stay 